everyone, it is Kaylin from Edit Needs. And today I am bringing you a tripod video. These are two tripods that are pretty affordable and not the best, best high quality, but it will do for a beginner YouTuber or beginner photographer. Uh, so the first tripod is the Manfrotto Compact Advanced Tripod. It is $99, so that is really affordable for a tripod. It's 4.5 stars in ratings, so that is pretty great. A review says that it's safe with a heavy camera or lens, so if you have a heavy camera or a big lens, it will be safe and sturdy with that. Uh, it gets tall, and this is a lightweight tripod, and it folds and it fit fits in a lot of places. It, uh, that implies, I guess, that it folds very s small, very small. Uh, the cons, though, the base plate covers battery flap, and you have to take the camera off to change the battery. That's a review left by someone that they didn't really like that. Um, and then the uncomfortable bag straps is also something someone doesn't like. The bag straps isn't a big deal, obviously, and really neither is the base plate, so I would give this probably a 4.4 stars, but I haven't used it. The one I use is a Manfrotto also. This is a pro camera support Manfrotto. Um, I'm not sure. Okay, this is... Um, I'm not actually sure what tripod exactly that I use for my videos, but it is an, a Manfrotto, and both of these that I am telling you about are Manfrotto, and I think they are very great quality. The next tripod is a Manfrotto Compact Action Tripod. It is 4.5 stars rating on Google, and it has a 143 five stars and 79 four stars. The price is $69.88, so it is an affordable price. The pros, it is easy to set up, and it is sturdy and lightweight. Um, it has a cool design. These are all basically uh, the pros and cons that I'm telling you about are reviews left by people. Um, I just looked through a bunch of reviews for you guys because I have not used these, but uh, from the reviews, they both look pretty good. This lady said that more she was more than pleased for the price range, um, so it was a good tri tripod for the price that it is, so basically $70, um, and it only it stands 18 inches when it's folded down to as small as it gets. So that gets really small. So it would be good if you're traveling and you want to fit it in your suitcase, uh, bag, etc. And the cons that I found are just that it stands only five feet tall. So if you want to do something uh, like an intro for a YouTube video or just like a family photo, it's not the best for that. It's more for even a nature photo, um, but it only stands about five feet tall. So it doesn't stand super tall, but... If that's okay with you, then it's a great tripod. I hope you guys liked this video, and if you want me to do more uh, reviews on things, like cameras or lenses and things like that, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, and also comment down below video suggestions, subscribe, so that I will keep making videos for you guys. And I just hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in my next one. Thanks for watching. Bye! Every shade of gray.